so for this video here I'm just gonna be making a city park scene so I can use it in some upcoming videos right here I got some green felt which I'm gonna be using for grass and I remember having more of it but I can't find it so I'm probably gonna spread it out a bit and then paint more grass and stuff over top of it I also have different types of moss so I can use to have different plant life and stuff going on in the park as well as these little wooden stumps here which I'll put around the park as well but yeah let's get started I'm actually gonna go in the backyard and try and find some sticks and what other debris I can find that I can somehow incorporate into putting it into the park. Bruh. So here's where I'm at so far. I just hot glued the whole base together. This back piece flips up. I'm gonna hot glue it here and I'm probably gonna put like bushes and stuff here and I am also going to put just patches of grass and then I'll paint dirt and paint more grass so it will all hopefully blend together when it's done. So what I've been doing so far is just I gathered some sticks up, I've been putting hot glue on the sticks and then rolling them in different moss. I have a different trees around the park and what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put like a small piece of cardboard just at the bottom here and hot glue it there so I'll be able to move the trees around and it'll be easier for filming oh here's where I'm at so far I got the bushes hot glued in the back here I have the grass splayed out so I'm gonna paint brown on the ground here for dirt and then once that dries I'm gonna put green over top of it and try and mix the green so it all kind of looks the same and I also got this tree here <laughs> I love that. that I think that looks sick and this is gonna be painted as well so I can have it wherever I want on my display and I'm gonna be doing the same with these different types of trees. So this is where I'm at with all the trees. What I've been doing is hot gluing the sticks to the cardboard and while it's cooling down I've been grabbing this moss stuff and making molding it together so it'll kind of keep its shape like that and keep the tree sturdy enough so it'll stay like that i've also just been adding a bit more to the cardboard because i've just been having them by themselves like that so i'm adding a bit more moss and stuff around all the trees just thought of something just now i'm gonna just use a glue stick go all over the whole thing and then just sprinkle dirt and the moss everywhere. It would probably be a lot better than just individually eating it all. So here's how all the trees are looking right now, and I think they look pretty cool, I like how they turned out. I'm still gonna paint on the bottom here a bit, so that cardboard is gonna be gone. As well as the main base here, I'm gonna give it a clear coat to try and keep all the moss and stuff together. I'm not sure if it'll work, but 
I still want to at least attempt to do it. And then after that, I'm going to paint the whole thing. I'm going to be adding brown and greens. And the back here, it's going to be painted black, as well as some green for bushes and everything. And then after that, I think I should be done. I'll just add these as well as adding the trees around and I think that should be everything. Uh, I might make a street lamp as well but I'm not entirely sure if I'll be able to figure that out. Alright so this is how the city park is looking so far. I've clear coated everything. I spray painted some brown here and I'm just going to paint the back now and also paint the different shades of green and brown and try and blend it all together. So, yep. And this is what everything looks like when it's all finished up. And I really like how it turned out. I was a bit iffy at first, but I think everything looks pretty cool. And it doesn't necessarily have to be a city park scene, because I can just get rid of the dumpster and the bench here. And then just have like a fight scene in the forest with Hulk and Wolverine, or whatever I need to use it for. So thank you for watching, as always, and I'll see you in the next video.